Demands broadly start with disclosure and divestment. As of right now, students do not have access to where their money is going when they pay tuition fees to this university. So crucially, our first demand is full disclosure of financial investments. Crucially about Israel, right? Well, we want to know where all of the money is going. We think that that's key for students to know where their money is going, whether it's about Israel or not. But then, with this knowledge, we would like to pursue full divestment from two things. First, from all arms manufacturing companies. Whether it's the current genocide in Gaza or other armed conflict around the world, our university should not be investing in that. This is a situation where we should be learning and contributing to education in a safe community, not to international And conflict. secondly, we request and demand that the university divest from all holdings and any entities that sponsor or are complicit in Israeli occupation, apartheid, and the current genocide in Gaza. Additionally, we have boycott demands, key of which is the demand to stop banking with Barclays, which the university currently does. Barclays has been completely Implicit in the architecture of Israeli apartheid, and so that's a key demand from the boycott, divestment, and sanctions global movement. And our last demand is that the university commits to a Palestinian-led rebuilding of the Gazan higher education sector. Okay.